The fugitive from justice charge was dismissed after Vladimir Zavkowski agreed to extradition back to New Hampshire, where he'll face seven counts of negligent homicide. Authorities say he was behind the wheel of a 2016 Dodge pickup truck when he crashed into a group of motorcyclists on Route 2 in Randolph Friday evening. Seven people were killed, three more were hurt. This is a tragedy. It's a real tragedy for all of those families. I read the newspaper accounts. I don't know anything more about it than that. Um, but he is still innocent until proven guilty, and I hope that uh, everyone respects that. Local, state, and federal agencies are investigating the crash. The Coas County attorney says there was enough evidence to bring charges against the 23-year-old. Looked at the evidence carefully. Uh, state troopers and investigators have been working around the clock uh, for the last three days and since Friday when this event, unfortunate event unfolded. And so we had probable cause and we, and we made an arrest. He also made an appearance back in 2017 on two drug charges, which he entered guilty pleas and paid a fine. And now Savkowski is expected to make an appearance in Coas County courtroom tomorrow afternoon on those seven negligent homicide charges. Reporting live in Springfield, Massachusetts, I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.